Of course. I walk back into Markarth and then it starts snowing. That's about my luck, isn't it? All right. Break the law in Markarth, and it's off to sit in a mine with you. So I've heard. Right. What do I need to do? Treasury house, right? Hmm? Hopefully I can do this without any more bloodshed. Good morning. At least not in the treasury house, anyway. Huh. They're decorating for something. Oh, good, there's somebody here this time. The treasury house is really just for patrons of the Silverblood family. You don't belong here. I mean, you're right. I'm sorry. We're only interested in helping our patrons. But, uh... What kind of patrons do you have? If you don't mind my asking. For one, the landowners of the Reach. It goes without saying that they rely heavily on us for our silver and support. All the miners, farmers, and laborers in the Reach get their daily wages through us. Nepos the Nose handles that part of our business. He has a way with the workers. Right. So, uh, is he in charge, or...? You want Thonar Silverblood. He handles all the family business. If you're here to talk politics, though, you'd want his brother, Thongvor. He spends most of his time in Understone Keep. Right. Anything else you can tell me about your, uh, employers? The Silverbloods? It's an old family, very well respected throughout the Reach. The Silverbloods run nearly all the lands in this hold, as well as the local inn. And of course they own Sidna Mine, the finest prison and source of silver in Skyrim. Right. Well, I can see that it's uh, not my kind of I have records I need to tend to. Business. When she says the landowners of the Reach. I'm going to go out on a limb and assume that she means the Forsworn. Which would mean... She's in on it too. I'm not sure about the rest of the Silverbloods. I work silver, like my father. And his father before Good him. for you. An honorable trade. Probably. Depending on who they're working silver for. Okay, let's go talk to Eltris. Uh oh. Oh no. This can't be good. Is that Eltris? We warned you, but you just had to go and cause trouble. Now you have to pin all these recent murders on you. Silence witnesses. Work, work, work. What did you do to Eltris? Same thing we do with all the other natives who want to change things around here. We had a nice little deal going between Thonar and Madanak until you and Eltris started snooping around. Well, you wanted to find the man responsible for those killings. You'll have plenty of time with the King in Rags when you're in Sidna Mine. You're not going to take me quietly. You'll never leave Markarth. I'll kill you for what you did to Eldris. <laughs> That's your best, huh? <sighs> Do your worst. This is not enough room to swing this thing. Oh, I'm in trouble. This is what?
All right, prisoner. Eyes front. You're in sit in the mine now, and we expect you to earn your keep. There's no resting your hide in a cell in this prison. Here you work. You'll mine ore until you start throwing up silver bars. You got it? I'm sorry, I'm a little deaf in this ear. Could you repeat that? Don't get smart with me. I'm in charge. You keep it up, I'll have your toes cut off. All right, open her up. Now you, get down there. Look, after what the guards did to me, frankly, I feel like being snarky all I want. Throw me in here with no food and no water and expect me to mine for my keep. Sure, fine. Great. How am I going to get out of this mess? You know, when they had the healers patching me up, I did not expect to get thrown in here anyway. Probably should have. Fine. It'll give me something to do anyway. My daughter died. Things won't be the same without her. Oh. What are you in for, new blood? So you're like me. Murder. Violent one, huh? Best keep that to yourself, new blood. Others find out, they'll consider that a challenge. My advice? Serve your time at the pickaxe and get out. You don't want to end up getting a shiv in the guts over a bottle of skooma. Great. What are you in for? A Nord nobleman I served was stabbed in the night. Wasn't me, but I knew I'd be blamed. So I ran, joined the Forsworn, started killing, got caught. Now I'm here. You joined the Forsworn? Why? Why would you do that? Because life was better under the old ways. No Nords and their laws. One day the Forsworn will paint the walls of Markarth in your kinsman's blood. Best you not be there on that day, Nord. Did you really just say that to me? Now if you'll excuse me. I'm going to walk away so that I don't take this pickaxe to his head. The Forsworn already painted the walls of Markarth with my kinsman's blood. I was sent here because someone said I was a Forsworn. You know, for all my complaining that I wasn't going to be able to get this stuff out of the rocks, I mean, it's not like I'd like the strength for it. I'm innocent. The Nords framed me. I was nowhere near that murder weapon. What'd you do? What are you in for? Guards say I murdered someone. I was just sleeping off some meat in my aunt's house. That didn't stop them from arresting me. I didn't even know who they said I killed. Oh. Well, I suppose there are worse things. How long have you been in here? A couple of years. I wasn't a Forsworn when I came, but I joined up when I got in. Easier that way. Is everybody in this prison mm -hmm. a Forsworn? I wonder how Grandma Bethella is doing. She's probably worried sick about me. Bethella is your grandmother? Well... Yarrow decided I was too much of a problem. Threw me in here with the Forsworn. All right, what did you do? I got locked up one too many times. Now I'm in for life. Oh, great. What'd you get locked up before before? The first time, thieving. The second time, thieving.
thieving. The third time, thieving. It kind of keeps going like that. Ah. I'll watch my pickaxe then. Alright then. <laughs> Doesn't seem like he's a forsworn. Yeah, at least I'm not the only one, probably. Don't reach for a shiv around me or we'll both regret it. Yeah. What's your story? <laughs> Don't do that! Look, you want me to mine or not? Fine. I'll not swing it like a mad woman. It's something to do anyway. You know, you didn't answer my question. What do you want of digging to do? What's your story? Why are you in here? I don't want to talk about it. Oh. All right then. Yeah, I'll leave you to it then. I don't really want to get in his way. Seems like there should be... Maybe that just used to be a... An, a vein or something. It looks like it should be a secret door. Like, I would know anything about that. How often have I delved into barrows? Once. Right? Ah, oh, my memory is going. Not really, but yeah, not as bad as some old people in the village. Don't reach for a shiv around me, or we'll both regret it. Yeah, I don't doubt that. Seems to me, if you start more trouble while you're in here, you just get, you know, knocked about. Is the only reason why I'm not caving his skull in right now. Eh, he misses his daughter. I miss my son. This is going to be painful, I think. I'm not used to being underground. I'm not used to being underground with nothing to do except break rock. It's not elegant, but... <sighs> if nothing else, it helps me get my anger out a bit. I don't want to be here. As far as I can tell, I am the only Nord in this prison. I have a one lockpick and that's not going to do me any good. I'm the only Nord in this prison. And I'm the only woman. Not that I think any of the young men in here would be stupid enough to try anything, but... One never knows. What's this? Looks like there must have been a cave in or something. Maybe they dug into the keep. I don't know. Is 
there anything down here or it's all pretty much rubble it looks like oh this is going to be tedious other prisoners get suspicious when we talk to each other so keep it down ah so what are you in for I'm a forsworn one of our raids went bad and I got captured would have been fine dying for the reach with my kinsmen, but the Silver Bloods want their ore mine, so they threw me in here. You know, I'm not sure what I was expecting. How long have you been in here? Year seven, I think. Surprised I haven't cut my own throat out by now, but something keeps me going. Great. See you. <laughs> Cabbage. Well, I suppose it's something, isn't it? Don't worry, I'm not going to steal your cabbages. <sighs> what I wouldn't give for an ale right now, though. Yeah, fine, I'll do some mining. I can feel you judging my technique. Give an old woman a break, will you? <laughs> 